Hi, Enchong. Thank you so much for giving us a few minutes of your time. I know how busy you are, and I know I heard that you have a new show, so congratulations. And um, I want to take this time also to let you know that I watch your vlogs, and um, I really think that you inspire a lot of people. So, together, let's na po tayo by learning from Enchong um, through some questions. So, for my first question, what are your realizations during this pandemic? Um, I've been I've been telling in my interviews that I realize that we have so much yet we need so little. Um, all of a sudden, all of the things that I bought last year, parang it's I don't want to say it's useless, but it's somehow I somehow it's useless. Alam mo yun, parang um, there's no place to go. Um, the people that um, really needs help are parang more of food, more of their necessities. And if I, I, I told myself I can focus my strength or, or my privilege towards that more than thinking about, okay, what's the next hottest thing on the market now? What should I get? What should I buy? Parang now I have more realization that, you know, as a community, we, we really need to help each other out, especially during this time. That's true. So parang there are different things that you value now more totally than different. before. Okay. All right. For my second question. So my channel is all about living a life that is fully alive. So pwede mo ba kami bigyan ng like three tips on how to live life to the fullest? Um, living life to the fullest based on my personal experience I guess um, number one that really helped me a lot is working hard um, being diligent um, there's something in being diligent that you get a leverage you get ahead of everyone else just because no, not a lot of people are down for the hard work not a lot of people are down for the dirty work. So um, it really helped me a lot um, from swimming to studying to um, show business. It's something that I'm proud of. Number two, um, hmm. I think there is this idea that karma always work both ways. Um, for myself, when I... I no, I'm not doing something because I know that karma will um, give back, diba? Yeah. It's more of, I want to do this because that's how I feel for that moment. Mm -hmm. But I realized that um, every time I do good, something good comes back. But every time when I do something not so good, mm -hmm. the events that happen in my life are the same. So I'm, I'm very careful with that and I'm very mindful now, especially as I get older, that um, do what, y if, if I'm the other person accepting that um, gesture, that action, I would be happy about. So I would continue doing that because I would feel for other person. You know, empathy plays a lot of role towards that. Um, number three, uh, hmm. Siguro sharing, sharing n n not only with material things, but sharing your time, sharing your energy, sh sharing your um, money, your resources, A any types of sharing, masarap sa pakiramdam. And I feel like the purpose of everyone is to really, you know, share whatever you have um, for those who doesn't have a lot. Um... I'm 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 very happy that I got to a stage or a maturity wherein I see sharing as an act of helping the community, helping the people around me. Because if I help other people, the community will grow, the community will move forward. Wow, that's so nice. And I really like what you said. Like that's how I think too about not really karma, but when you plant a seed of goodness, you will also reap goodness. And of course, if you do something not good, there are consequences for it. So 
Yeah, that's really nice. So, and of course, sharing and giving back to the community. So, thank you. Last question. Um, my channel is also about uh, adventure. I'm an adrenaline junkie. I like jumping off cliffs and <laughs> high places. So, <laughs> so for you, if there is one big, like, crazy adventure that you haven't done before or you've been wanting to do, that says, of course, after the pandemic, what would that be? Ah, uh, um. I don't mind doing skydiving again because um, last year I was able to do it. But if something that I've been wanting to do that I haven't done before, it's yung nakasabit ka sa, sa boat, sa speed boat, something oh. like that. I haven't done that. I've been ah, wanting. Ah, okay. <laughs> so, where did you do your skydiving? I plan to do it next um, year. We were in Dubai for a show, so after the show, I said, um, "Give uh, give me one day to just explore." Because every time I would go abroad, I would always um, set aside time for for myself, even just walking by alone, just absorbing all the goodness from the universe, diba? I, I I like doing that, and a lot of people yeah. gets weirded out. Like, yeah. um, are you sure that's what you wanna do, and that's all yeah. you do? Parang sabi ko, yeah, there's something about um, being alone and um, talking to yourself and meditating that really helped me a lot in terms of mental health and everything that um, I understand now. I feel like a lot of it com came from medita meditation. Nice. That's true. That's how I do it too when I travel because I'm a flight attendant. So every time I go to a place, I try to take it all in, I learn from yeah. it. And then, of course, what I see in you, I think you have so much self-love. You understand how it is to take care of others and yourself. So, um, and Chong, thank you so much. Oh, there's one more last question. One, 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 one last. Because your mom course. told us, if you're going to play a uh, priest as your role because i'm studying also theology how are you preparing for this role um i talked to the head writer the creative of the production and i told them you know i i want someone that would bring back the the light na diba, there are people na first time mo palang makita there's this um, lightness, diba? there's this um, sunshine that you see, the, the vibrance, the energy of one person. Mm -hmm. You can always see that. Eh? And I always believe on those. Um, I, I just told them that if, I, if I'm going to portray this, if I'm going to say yes to this role, I, I want someone who would um, bring that light. You know, I, I, I feel like we're in a very... Um, colorful situation now. And I feel like we we need more goodness. We need more light. We need more um, uh, goodness around us. So, sabi ko lang, I want a character that unang tingin mo palang mararamdaman mo na sa kanya. So I'm 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 hoping that I can <laughs> get that. But we'll see. We'll see. <laughs> Ah, okay. Sige. So, there. Thank you. And we will pray for you that you will really get that part. And, and even now, I just want to thank you. You really are a light to the world by just doing what you do and for the inspiration or the words of inspiration you've shared with us today. Thank you, Anchong, and God thank bless you. you. Thank you. Bye.